make a video detailing uh, the effects of religious implications, and I wanted to talk to that pretty much everything we have in Western society has been uh, given to us by religion. Our calendar, the Gregorian calendar, our system of time we operate on has come from the Christian faith. And there are all sorts of other psychological and uh, subtle components in how we live our lives and how life is lived from day to day that come from religion and uh, religious mentality. And I'll first preface that you know, I'm not religious, you know, I was raised as a Christian uh, Catholic school my whole life. Uh, I didn't agree with it. Uh, and that's, that's fine if you want to believe whatever you want to believe. But that isn't the point of this video. Uh, the point of this video is to describe uh, a certain pathology that operates almost unconsciously in people who have religion and people who don't have religion. And it's something that affects everyone. And even in, re in regards to the idea of a relationship or marriage, it is the, our, our entire structure and foundation of a relationship has been supplanted by a religious theology. Our entire concept of marriage comes from a religious theology. Uh, an entire set of moral virtues, whether they're virtuous or not, is regard. It, it, is, it doesn't matter. But an entire system of virtue and morality comes from religion. Uh, the concept of original sin and uh, the ideology that humans are born inherently wrong sinners, uh, flawed beings, that is to say. I, I'm not a person who agrees with the concept of original sin. I, I don't think humans are inherently born to be bad or to be good. I think they uh, model after a society and a pathology that they've generally been programmed to be uh, depending upon the level of how much they really question into reality. And the main point of this video is to describe that uh, there, there's a pathology operating within everyone in Western society that is fundamentally religious and for the most part it is on a subconscious level in terms of how it affects consciousness, how it affects lives, how it affects our minds, and in terms of the kind of lives we live, the kind of things we want, the kind of lifestyles we want, has all been supplanted through modern religion. And for me, that's not really the lifestyle I want to live. I want to be a person who defines my own relationships who creates my own reality, who has, you know, my own beliefs and ideas and convictions and my own virtues, virtues that are my own, virtues that aren't what other people tell me are good and bad, uh, or what I have ascertained through my own experience is good or bad. And this is the general gist of the video. If, if you'd like to further elaborate anything in this video, or if you have something you'd like to add, uh, please feel free to. Uh, it, it's something I've been interested in, and uh, anyone who has anything more to share would be duly appreciated. Thank you.